Hello, you all come to solve this math problem, which is x power 3 over x plus x plus x is equal to 12, to find the values of x from this equation. Now, from here in the numerator, it is x power 3 over, in the denominator, x plus x plus x is 3x is equal to 12. Then, in the next step, this x will cancel this one of the x, so this power of 3 will be power of 2. Then, in this 12, is same as 12 over 1, so we'll cross multiply. Then, it will be x square times 1 is x square is equal to 3 times 12 is 36. Then, we'll apply square root in both sides. So, this square root will cancel with this square, then it will be x is equal to square root of 36 is plus or minus 6. So in here we have two solutions, which is positive 6 and negative 6. Therefore, this is our final answer. Or to solve in another method from our problem, which is x power 3 over x plus x plus x is equal to 12. It will be this, which is x power of 3 over x plus x plus x is 3x is equal to 12. Then this 12 is same as 12 over, over 1. Then we'll cross multiply. It will be x square times 1 is, I mean x power of 3 times 1 is x power of 3 is equal to 3x times 12 is 36x. Then we take this 36x into the left side. So it will be x of 3 minus 36x is equal to 0. Then from here x is common. So we'll take x out of bracket. x of 3 divided by x is x square. Then negative 36x divided by x is negative 36. Bracket is equal to 0. Then it will be x bracket x square minus 36 to be minus 36 is 60 square then bracket is equal to 0 then from this x square minus 6 square this is the form of a perfect square so it will be this x then x square minus 6 square is same as bracket x plus 6 bracket x minus 6 bracket is equal to 0 then from here we have three solutions whereas this first solution is x is equal to this zero and the second solution x plus six is equals to zero so this six will take into the right side so it will be x is equal to negative six and the third solution x minus six is equals to zero this negative six will take to the right side it will be x is equal to six but for this x is equal to 0, this is not the correct answer. So, so this solution, the second method, will reject it. This is not sufficient method. So the first method is the correct method. Now, to check for the value of x is equal to 0, if it, is, it will bring a correct answer. From here, x power of 3, it will be 0 power of 3 over 0 plus 0 plus 0 it is 0 so it will be 0 power of 3 is 0 0 divided by 0 it is undi undefined so the value of x is equals to 0 this is not a correct answer so the second method is not the correct method for the value of x is equal to 6 we will substitute here it will be 6 power of 3 it is 216 over 6 plus 6 plus 6 is 18 then 216 divided by 18 is equal to 12 which is the same so x is equal to 6 is the correct answer and for x is equal to negative 6 it will be negative 6 power 3 it is negative 216 over negative 6 plus negative 6 plus negative 6 is negative 18 then this and this would be positive 
this divided by this is equal to 12. So also this is the correct answer. So our answers is 6 and negative 6. So the first method is the correct method, but the second method to give these three solutions is not the correct method. Thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps to miss out. Subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video. Bye bye.